Hi there and welcome, I'm The Technician Project and today's tutorial is going to explain how to update and restore an Apple device back to the original settings. This is very similar to our Force Restart an Apple device video. What we're going to do is we're going to boot up iTunes, we're going to plug our device into our computer, mine is a Mac, and we're going to hold down the home button and the power button for at least 5 to 10 seconds until the Apple logo appears. If you keep holding down those two buttons, a new logo will appear, and that will be the iTunes logo with a cable underneath it. That is telling you to plug it into the computer. If you do this whilst it's plugged into the computer, the device will automatically sync with the computer. A message comes up, if you want to restore it, you can restore it back to factory default, it will wipe everything off the iPad. So I'm going to click restore today and then this box comes up saying are you sure you want to restore the factory default settings, all media and data will be erased and the newer version of software will be installed. I'm going to click restore and update and it's going to extract the software and it's going to prepare the software to be installed onto the iPad. This may take a couple of minutes. Once the software has been verified on the iPad, it will take five seconds and it will appear in the iTunes window. We're going to wait for that to happen. And you give it a couple of minutes whilst the iPad's still finishing up doing its few little bits. And then it will appear in the iTunes app like that. Welcome to your new iPad. If we click continue, we can restore from a backup we've already got, or we can create it as a brand new iPad. If you enjoyed the video today, please leave a like rating and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching and see you next time.